In this video, we will look at prime mining, which is exploring for gold and silver in Mexico. Canadian Mining Report is not a financial advisor, and this video is intended for informational purposes only and does not constitute investment advice. The past performances of the stocks mentioned are not indicative of future results, and the information included is based on publicly available sources and consensus estimates that may or may not be reliable. Canadian Mining Report management or employees may have positions in or marketing relationships with the companies mentioned. Prime Mining is the sixth largest TSXV listed gold explorer with a market cap of 252 million Canadian dollars, with the group shown here excluding TSXV listed juniors that have already moved into the development stage. All of these TSXV listed explorers have seen share price declines over the past year, with most of the drop over just the past three months, along with the broader equity market decline that's especially hit small caps, with newfound gold down 43%, Rupert Resources and Arizona Metals nearly flat, falling just 1% and 3% respectively, SK Mining down 18%, Tudor Gold down 42%, while Prime Mining has declined the most of the group, down 46%. The company is exploring the Los Reyes project, which is in Sinaloa province in western Mexico. It's seen considerable historical exploration and production from as far back as the 1770s over several deposits. There's also been considerable exploration over the past 25 years at Los Reyes, with $20 million spent to drill 51,000 meters by a combination of several companies including Minera Alamos, Meridian Gold, Vista Gold, and Great Panther Silver, but this has already been strongly outpaced by prime mining since just 2019, with 25,650 meters drilled in its Phase 1 and 40,250 meters drilled in its Phase 2, with an additional 50,000 meters planned. Prime reported strong Los Reyes drilling results in February 2020 with a 6.75 grams per ton gold and 58.2 grams per ton silver over 39 meters for a gold grams thickness of 263 and silver grams thickness of 2,270. But the share price really started to pick up with the rise in gold through mid-2020 and with the company reporting results of 1.78 grams per ton gold and 71 grams per ton silver over 63 meters in June 2020 for a particularly high silver grams thickness of 4,473. The next set of results were not high for grams thickness because of a low width in meters, but they did have the highest grade for Los Reyes that's been reported so far for gold at 8.95 grams per ton over 4.5 meters, which drove up the share price. This was followed by a very strong silver result in June 2021 with 1,060 grams per ton over 7.5 meters for a grams thickness of 7,951, which continued to push up the share price to a peak of five Canadian dollars in November 2021. The share price has declined since, mainly on the broader equity market decline, even though there was a strong set of results in June 2022 with 62 grams per ton gold and 978 grams per ton silver over 3.6 meters. Comparing the top gold drill results of the largest TSXV listed explorers over the past few years based on grams thickness, Prime Mining has the lowest results versus the group with a top gold grams thickness of just 263. However, we have to note that this gold grams thickness is certainly not a perfect measure and it excludes the large contribution from silver at Los Reyes, while most of the other company's projects are entirely gold. But we can conclude that Prime's results are not as outstanding as those seen at Newfound Gold, for example, with a peak gold grams thickness of 3,743 or Rupert Resources at 1,230 and are considerably below Tudor at 827. Although adjusted for silver, Prime's results could come closer in range to the results from SK with a peak 470 grams thickness for gold. Leave any comments you have on the video below and visit our website www.canadianminingreport.com for more on the TSXV Junior Gold Miners, including our product, the Top 50 TSXV Metal Miners, weekly updates, and longer form industry reports.